Okay, it's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. Link to the past randomizers tonight. This is uh, the first randomizer we're doing after a two-week hiatus, pretty much, but only because I've been busy the past couple weeks on Saturday. So, let's get back into it. Gotta beat our fantastic PB of buck thirty-seven forty-nine, but that's mostly gonna be up to RNG, as it always is. I would be happy with like a, a any sort of sub two, even a low two would be pretty good. Um, I can't really complain about any of that, but just something we'll have to try to figure out here and see what we're gonna do here. So three, two, one, go 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 go. Let's see what we got in the first chest. Oh, uh, 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 it's the Moon Pearl. Wow, okay, okay. Very interesting, interesting start. My goodness. Strong start, which makes me a little bit worried what RNG's got up the sleeves for us later on. Man, poor right side blue guard always gets hit in the face with a sign. Ooh, the last magic's on tree pull. See what Uncle's carrying in his pockets today. Got some cash from the bar last night. Maybe. No, some busy bands. Hey, that's fucking great. I don't know what he was doing out there in the world with some bombs in his pockets, though. That makes me a little bit worried. Uncle, what you doing, man? What you doing? Got ten arrows there. Okay, so not great. But having early bombs is nice. Having the moon pearl early is real nice. What's in the church, though? Ah, uh, we're stealing a burrito from the church. That was probably the priest's little lunch thing. I kind of feel bad about that. Only for the fact that it was uh, nothing useful to us. It's gonna kind of probably throw it in the trash on the way out. All right, well, let's check out uh, Umberjack, Umberjack Ledge. Head on down to Kakariko. As is our typical route here. Not gonna, not gonna bother with the tree pull again. We can check what the crab's dropping, though. Maybe that'll be something of value. Eh? Like hearts. Nope. Zero value to be had. We got a lumberjack ledge. It is a big old 20. Okay. That is of no value to us. Absolutely zero value. Well, I mean, 20, 20 dollars of value, but still. Not really worth it. Not especially worth it, so let's check Mushroom Spot, Thieves Den, and all that cool stuff. Uh, I didn't want that dude to be around here. Fuck you, bird. It's one hit in. What a shit. Mushroom Spot's got a piece of candy. We'll grab it. We'll grab it only because I don't like being at three, hour, three ass hearts here. About Thieves Den, though. What do we got here? What do we got here? Oh, damn! Early ass sword. Okay. Plastic sword is better than nothing. It gives us uh, some reliable offensive capability. Fuck you, bird. Fuck you, bird. Arrows. All right. I was kind of hoping for some cash. But that's all right. That's all right. Now we've got the means to go for her uh, first half escape. Get the three items that are in there. Got some bombs. I hope we get another pack of bombs at some point so we can finish off Kakariko and head to South Shore without having to stop in and buy some. Couldn't even buy some if we wanted to. We don't got the money. No money. Very, very, very poor seed today so far. Arrow cap. Boo. There, there's a big old 20. Thanks. Now some red goo. Okay. The bottle's good. Oh, the mirror. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Well, we're just about there. Just about there for Dark World access, we just need a glove and a hammer now. Alright, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Grab the mirror too. Not bad. Not bad value so far. Got enough cash to go get us some more bombs if we need to. I'd rather not. Rather not waste the money. Piece of candy there. Ouchies. Another piece of candy there. Alright, one more. We've got another heart. 
Bizzity Bams. All right, that's good. There we go. There's another piece of candy and a full heart container to boot. All right, what a lovely well. A lovely, lovely well. Not quite enough money for the bottle vendor, though. That's annoying. Eight roops off. Now we've got enough bombs to finish off Kakariko. Can we get chicken throw? Nope. Oh, that's way too high on that one. Let's get some money here. Nope. The bloomerang. The bloomerang. But, since we got that bottle of red goo in the well, we can check Sick Kid right away. What's he got for us? Busy bams! Thanks, kid. Now, why you would hide bombs under your pillow like that is kind of weird. I mean, no judgment, but it's kind of weird. Oh, big old 50 at the back of the bar. They had, a, they had a pretty good night last night, apparently. And since we now got the hundo, go check bottle vendor right away in the area. Ah, uh, for the red meringue. Don't know if worth a hundred rupees. Let's see if the library holds anything other than literacy. Oh, library has the hammer. Okay, well, this will not be a bootless seed then. At the very least. What about race game? Race game has the single arrow. The arrow of destiny. Amazing. Okay, well. So we have eyes on the hammer. We know where it is. That's good. That's real nice. Just gonna have to find them boots. So just grab it. Oh, we do have the mirror, though, so we can do that. Fancy no double dip dam here. Meep, meep. Ten arrows, that's, I think, the... Oh, no, it's the second pack of ten arrows we've seen in chests. We had a ten arrow drop from something. Maybe it was the blue guard that we murdered on our way up to the castle the first time. And another ten arrows underwater. Wow, all right. Hopefully that's pointing us to an early bow. That would be real cool. That'd be real cool and fun. Ouch. Come on, hold on. Fuck you. I'll try this. Ah, dang it. Of course we didn't get the, the one that was most important. Oh, uh, hello. Welcome back. What do we got all up in here? Five chances at greatness. He's candy. Not great. Big old 20, not great. A fiver, even worse. Another big old 20. Come on. Ow, oh, nothing but crap. Nothing but crap in Mini Wormulon Cave today. That is unfortunate for us. Oops. Oh, jeez. Them crabs. Ooh, big old 20 drop. Whoa, whoa, careful. All right, let's not pull a dumb death on the way to Ice Cave, please. Uh, excuse me, fuck. Ah, dang it. The hitbox. All right, you know what? That's fine. That's fine. That's actually kind of fine. We'll leave Ice Rod Cave for another time, then. Head on back and go do front side escape. And we can even try to do Dark Room and get the Dark Chest and escape, too. Break a little sequence and see what we can get. Plus, we can bust a move on out right to the entrance with the mirror. It's real good. Good early mirror. Excuse me, fucko. 
Nothing. No, no good enemy drops just yet. Big ol' 20! Okay, well there's one of three. That wasn't, wasn't ideal. This kind of blows my mind how that dude sees me. Does he turn around, like, to face me when he does a little flop there? Ah, fuck it, doesn't matter. Excuse me. Also, excuse me. Oh, bombs are the uh, stun drop, huh? That's actually rather nice. Nope, come on. Get, no, no, no. <laughs> Dang it. Give me that bomb. I want that bomb. <laughs> Ooh, ice rod, huh? Okay. Well, that's, that's an interesting pickup. That saves me from having to find it later on if T-Rock does indeed become required. Alright, I'm a big old coward, so we'll do some half and half pot swing strats here. Ouch. Ba -da -da -da. What do we got? Uh, nothing but a piece of candy. Boo! All right. Well, let's let's try. Ah, oh, fucker! Blech. No, stop it! Fucking bomb! Damn it! Uh, this is gonna be a real interesting attempt at the dark room now, for the simple fact that I've got one heart. Probably shouldn't even try it. Shouldn't even try it, but we're gonna try it anyways. Oh, rats. <laughs> ah, dang it. <laughs> this is trying to avoid the inevitable death of snakes there. Alright, so let's just say fuck it. Really waste a whole heck of a lot of time there. I just wanted to see what would, what we could pull out of there. And the answer is apparently nothing. So we'll just book it uh, away from here for now. Oh shit, that's a stone block. All right, all right. Probably should just save and quit back to house anyways. So, not really much of value in Frontside Escape besides that ice rod. So let's see what Sahash is hiding from us. Oh, also, let's check the map here. What do we got? Crystal, crystal, crystal. Normal ass crystals all around. Which could lead to some very, very, very interesting Dark World shenanigans depending on what is and is not a pendant. Alright, Sahash, what's in your back room here? Samaria? Power glove? Piece of candy. Oh, very interesting. So that does perhaps get us up the mountain. Um, but for now, we're going to go into Eastern. That seems to be a popular place for good items. <laughs> F you, Mini Armos. I guess it does give us the backside escape as well. Ba -da -da -da. 
Actually, three items here. There's the Keen O'Brien. Not exactly what I wanted to see. But we'll take it. Just hoping for a hook shot or something. Maybe boots. So we are now a hammer away from Dark World Access. The compass! Worst, most worthless items now. I mean, between that and the burritos, not exactly what you want to see. got only the single appear there. That was pretty fucking sweet. Pretty fucking sweet there. There's the big key so we can hit the chest on the way through. It looks like we'll be probably rotating around anyways. So unless one of these two has the bow, we'll have to bust a move on out of here. Oh, the flippers, huh? Oh, that gets us a few places. It's a Zora Ledge item. It's a shame that we don't have any money. It's a big ol' shame we don't got no money. I also forgot these were uh, dark rooms. Ouch. You. Nice. Pretty smooth dark rooms there. Enjoy being able to get those without a problem. So what do we do then? Do we? I think we S and Q back to house. Uh, let's see the, the good old damage boost here. There we go. Nothing but a piece of candy. All right. Well, that's uh, all three items at least. Now we don't have to go back for something that we can't get. Uh, yeah. Let's go check Hobo and. Lake Hylia Island, I suppose, huh? Let's see, where's the closest entrance for this, do you think? So I don't think I can jump... I can jump down here and kind of go across. Yeah, there we go. Piece of heart there. And we can check uh, Ice Cave, or Ice Rock Cave as well. They're kind of running out of places to go. I mean, besides Waterfall Wishing and all that cool stuff up there. I really wish I had more... more money so we could take care of Zora all at once here. And I'd hate to go fucking do a grind for a butt-ton of money. Well, there's a hundred bucks. It's something. Pretty much the ideal grind spot is that rock uh, by the entrance to the desert. That's only 50 at a pop. So it'll take us a while to get that amount of money, but... We need to, we need to. Go check Ice Rod Cave real quick, and then maybe we'll just probably just go up there and take a look anyway, see what's on Zora Ledge. Uh, I don't know what else we could do right away. We could, um, we could go up the mountain. We are familiar with that dark cave. Then we're in sequence break land, so it shouldn't be required at this point. Not yet, anyways. Fucking crab. Had eyes on me. Oh, plus I've got backside escape. I should probably do that first. Oh, look at that. Single ass rupee. I didn't miss anything by dying on my way over here the first time. I guess either way, we've got three items no matter where we go. We go to Backside Escape, we get three items. We go up to Zora, we get three items. The unfortunate part about that being that we don't have enough money to pay off King Ripoff himself, so... We'll leave an item up there, I guess, if we get, uh, In the Dark World, we can do Catfish Zora 
back to back if we need to. Bomb cap. Another bomb cap. Alright, so. No value there. <laughs> Let's check, uh. Check Zora Ledge really quick. Just quick pop in and pop out if it's disgusting garbage trash here. It is the Mitts. All right, well, that gets us Dark World access. How interesting. So, we're going to hope that uh, Zora himself has nothing of value. So I don't want to go grind up some money to get it. So, kind of glad. Kind of glad we came up here first. That was a good move. I think we'll still do a backside escape right away. For the simple fact that that's another three items that we can grab um, before we head into Dark World. Plus, now having Titans been instead of Hammer uh, gets us the quick Dark World access. Kakariko instead of having to loop up through Lost Woods first. Which makes me happy. Makes me real happy. So what do we got here? It's not going to be a burrito. One of them is probably going to be a key. Big old 20 and a key, of course. Uh, so we got another um, bottle out of that, too. Um, so I guess we go to Kakariko and hit Dark World then. So not terrible. Uh, not a terrible go at things so far. have much in the way of offensive weaponry or even really movement stuff either but we've got a lot of oopsie a lot of traversal type stuff a lot of overworld traversals it's mirror the pearl real good real good so far mm, and my uh all right, let's see what we got here. Crystal, 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 pod. Pod, mire, and ice are the pendants. Mire being green. And we've got, let's see, a five sixer there. The five sixer in Thieves Town, which makes me happy. A normal ass crystal on T Rock. And Skull Woods. We're going to go up to Skull Woods first. Only two items, only two possible items up there, but I've gotten screwed on more than one occasion by not going up there sooner than later, so we're going to check it out. Maybe get the two items early, maybe it'll pay off. Excuse me, fuckos. Actually learned to check that chest first because I... There's a locked door up here. That if you get a key, oh ouch! Wow, that's very painful. Oh, nice. You know what? I can I can get down with the blue mail. That's really that's a good find. That's a real nice find. So that gets you access all the way up to here, without having to dick through that worthless room down below. There's the big ass key. Uh, hmm. All right, we're not gonna we're not gonna do the bomb jump here because I think that would kill us. And that's assuming I even was able to do the bomb jump first try, which is generally not generally not possible. Well, not not uh, it's, I shouldn't say it's not possible. It's not likely that I'd get the bomb jump first try. At least not that one. Hey Sam, how you doing? Let's see. 
You get down with the sickness. Well, I, I would rather not be sick, so I don't want to get down with the sickness. Ouchies. Small ass key. Damn it. Alright, well, let's try the bomb jump then. I think that'll do it. Ah, fuck. <laughs> Alright, well, now I'm almost dead again. Go figure. So there's one, I think just one more chest to grab. Which hopefully is the second item so we can get the fuck out of here. And you know, if I'd had my druthers, I'd want it to be the fire rod so we could finish off Skull Woods, but you know, the likelihood of that happening is pretty slow. Nice eight pack there. So the beautiful part about this is that we've got Samaria, early Samaria, so fuck this room. Also, we're gonna grab the mirror. Ah, uh, nothing but a burrito. Nothing but a burrito. Alright, so Skullwood's play was sorta of useful. We got the blue mail. Or the gravity suit, I guess you could call it. Let's get the fuck out of here. So we're gonna have to double dip into Skull. Whoopsie. Excuse me, fucko. That dude is always on point. Oh, wait. Actually, while we're up here, let's check Bumper Cave. We can hit Cave North of Graveyard. I hope we find a heart soon, because that even though that beeping is at quarter speed, it's still annoying as heck. Excuse me, what's on Bumper Cave today? The boots? Ah, oh, shit. We got a little fetch quest going on. Oh, fuck, I'm probably gonna die here. Excuse me. Ah, oh, that's right, I don't have a shield. <laughs> Crap, where's that gonna put me? Uh, that's gonna put me in the light world, isn't it? Oops, I wanted to go Sanctuary. Excuse me. All right, but that puts our, our eyes on the boots there, which is good. No more beeping now, that's right. All right, silver lining, silver lining. So I'm kind of glad that we checked that, even if we did take it down there. You'd, you'd think this uh, stout-ass power armor that we're in could take a little poke from a spear, but I guess not. Luckily, we didn't lose much time since the portal is just right here. Alright, so as soon as we grab the magic cape, We'll be busting a move on over to Bumper Cave to grab the boots. And then busting a move on down. Oops. Oh, you fucko. All right, you can have that junk. It's fine. Busting a move on down to the library to grab the hammer. What a fetch questy. Fetch questy quest here. The last hard container. We'll take that. That's pretty reasonable at this point. Stormtrooper armor only designed for energy weapons. Right. Well, then why the hell did stormtroopers always go down in one shot, too? Like, if it's supposed to protect against that crap... Like, why was it always so weak? Like, you'd, you'd think the Empire could afford to outfit their troops a little bit, you know? Oh, half magic! Nice! That's very nice. Close enough, just barely. Bum, 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 bum. There, okay, so not really of much value, but the good thing about this seed is that Thieves Town is a crystal. And not just a crystal, the 5 6 -er crystal. So this will get us halfway to Double Chested Fairy. Very good, it's very nice. Thieves Town, pretty simple. We've got half magic plus a couple of coward strats that we can use if we really need to. It's gonna go great. 
We don't have hammer, so unfortunately, if something is in that big chest, we might be SOL. Well, whatever, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Piece of candy there. That is one of the items, isn't it? What are we with the Samus sprite? Oh, that. Oh, yeah, that's right. Zero suit. If we were using Zero suit, we'd be a Metro right now. Then dark rooms are no issue, not that they were already, but just in case. I feel like I forgot to get this other chest over here. So we're gonna go check. Maybe I did get it. Never mind. Yeah, I'm an idiot. Oh well, doesn't really cost us much time. I don't think it was- it wasn't an item, was it? It was something dumb and bullshit. Oh, it was the big key. Right, right, right. Yeah, big key, compass, uh, lamp, and something else. So far. I like this song. It's such a- it's a bumpin' song. I love it. Clean hell hallway like that. heart container. That works. It's item number tray. Puts us in good shape to get all the items without needing to check the big chest. Got two chances. Two out of three. 66.6 .6 repeating percent chance to get the last item without having to re-dive with the hammer. Here's hoping. Here's hoping we can play the odds correctly. Two chance. Let's see what blind's carrying. If blind has a burrito, we're gonna have to come back in here, probably. But if not, we'll be looking real nice for our Thieves Town dive. Oh, 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 actually. Ah, crap, I can't go back for it. <laughs> you old shit. Okay, just in case we need some coward strats here. The <clears throat> have the cane of Brian ready to go. Fucked up phase one of this. That's pretty solid phase two, though. Oop, careful. Ah, boom! Eat shit, bro. Eat shit, blind. Got him. He's dead. Ah, he's got the burrito! What a shit! What a shit. All right, well, maybe we won't have to go back in. Maybe we won't. That gets us crystal number one, nice. 34 flat. That's pretty reasonable, pretty reasonable. Ba -ba 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 -ba. 
let's see, what can we do now? We can do some of the fetch questy garbage. We've got the materials for it. So let's do digging game first. Grab the frog. We can grab the purple chest and then do cave south the grove and old stumpy and hype cave and blah, blah, blah. Spent some time Googling Stormtrooper armor and nobody has an answer. You'd think that'd be a good thing to have, like, info on, you know, right? But knowing the way that those... Nice. Pull on our container. That's pretty useful. Knowing the way that those movies can just print money, they could spend an entire fucking, like, two hours explaining Stormtrooper, hour, or St Stormtrooper armor, and people would go see that movie, I bet. So maybe that's why there's no info about it. They wanted to keep it hush-hush. It's a big old gosh dang shame we don't got that hammer yet. Take care of Peg Cave, but no go. All right, ten roops for a piece of candy. Dang it. So that was kind of a bust. Uh, digging game was full ass heart container, which was all right. Hitting south of Grove and old Stumpy soon. It's candy, that should be number four. Nice. 10 hearts, it's pretty solid. Cave South of Grove, you've got a big old 20, which I probably should have picked up anyway since I'm miraculously low on cash. Whatever, it's fine. Excuse me, fuckos. Pardon me. Coming through. Alright, what has Gary got in his lunchbox today? Maybe a hook shot? A hook shot or a, a, a better sword, perhaps? Fire rod? Magic cape, even? Ah, it's a big old 20. Why is he keeping his lunch money in his lunchbox? What a shit. What a little shit. He's too lazy to pack a lunch, so he just took some money. Get something for the Kakariko Canteen or something. What an ass. Alright, but we are in the area. Excuse me. In the area of Ye Old Hype Cave. Let's see if it lives up to its name. Any bets? Any bets on whether it actually does today? I'm gonna say no, just because Hype Cave has been unusually not hype for a while. Oh, 300, alright. Actually, kind of useful. Red Mail, hey, there's some hype. Full ass heart container, piece of candy, and another full ass heart container. Okay, you know, that's, that's, let's say about average, average hype. Uh, all right, so what does that put us at now? Probably, we don't quite have enough money for Zora just yet. We probably could have scammed some money off of something. Oh, I can't even get up there, though. Is there a way to get into the... Oh, there is. Okay, so I can swim around if I really need to. Which I'm going to do, I think. I think I can swim around. So 
I don't have the hammer to get through those pegs. I guess probably our next go is to go up to Hera. Although not having either hammer or hookshot sucks, because I can't hit, um... Uh, can't hit east side Death Mountain right away. Really shitty. So let's, uh, let's check Pyramid and Catfish. Maybe by then we'll have enough money to hit Zora as well. I should have grabbed that big 20 from the cave south of the grove. And I'd be that much closer. Oh, big ol' heart container on Pyramid, huh? I'll take it. We're right here, may as well jog up and grab the some bitch. So now, in an ideal world, Catfish would have some money, a 50 or greater. And then we could grab Zora right away. Then Zora would have, like, magic cape or something, so then we could bust a move on over, grab the boots, grab the hammer, and we'd be off to the races, but we'll have to see. See what we can pull out of our magic RNG-influenced hat here. You know, I'm kind of curious. Is it enough for me to toss a bomb down there? Nope. All right, damn. <laughs> really wake him up. All right, Catfish, what you got for us today? Ah, but a piece of candy. <clears throat> I don't think I can get back to the other side, though, can I? Because I don't have... I don't have hook shot. That's a shame. That's a, that's a real big shame. But that's all right. I guess we're going up the mountain. Now we can do dark side, or the, get the dark chest and escape. Kinda don't want to. Uh, like, I don't know. Kinda don't want to, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Because <laughs> uh, I think I did get a key, so we should be able to go back. Go backwards and grab it, right? Need to murder this defenseless rat. I think that's the one? Nice. Good guess. <laughs> eh. What? Well, there's a three hundo. That's a little something something, even if a little bit late. Next go is up the mountain. It'll get us to Hera and our second crystal, plus a few items on the way, but... Again, lacking that hook shot and or hammer. Makes this, uh... Not a great play. my way. Stupid dancing pickle. But I feel this is the the best play I've got at the time, considering the rest of my plays are going against single item locations. Without possibility of getting a crystal out of it right away, so eh. Pick your poison, I guess. Big old twenty. All right, well, old man had a, had about what you would expect an old man to have. A lot of cash. Bum, 
Arrow cap on spec rock. What about inside? A fiver. Nice. The value. Such great value. I suppose. Oh no, I can't do spike cave yet either because I don't have the hammer. Dang. That would have been something nice to get just totally taken care of right away while we're up here. But into Hera we go. Two items plus another crystal. About the best you could hope for sometimes. Hmm, I don't like that. I don't like the small key being down there. Means I'm probably headed to the basement before we get the big key. Unless this is the big key. Nope. <laughs> you should laugh. Yeah. That's gonna be enough and not soft lock me. about to say, do I have a fire source? Yes, I've got the lamp. Been a real short trip if I didn't. -da 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 -da. You fucking ass. Come on. Little shit. Hope it doesn't put the other two back, does it? Okay, good. There. Eat shit. So we're like one for six on the bomb jump across to the big chest. Hopefully, we can make it two for six. Big ol' 20! One of the items. Uh, I always can never manage to line this up properly the first time. There, I think that'll do it. Oh, please, please be enough! Yeah. Oh, dang it! No, I was a pixel, pixel to the south there. Son of a bitch. Oh, good. Yeah, no, back down here. Alright, it's fucking worthless, don't do it. Don't fucking do it. Watch, it's gonna be the burrito in there. Can that just be the thing? I hate it when I'm right. Fuck. I think I'm not right very often. I hate that the burrito was in there. So, Wormulon's gonna have the last item for us. Oh, jeez. Please be careful. And with no hammer and only plastic sword, this is gonna be a treat. 
a treat of a fight. Alright, you fuck hell. Come on, let's do it. Wow. Yeah, eat shit. One spin. I think it's what, four or five spins with plastic, right? Wow. Yeah, oh jeez. Oh, look out. Oh no! <laughs> Oh, damn it. Fuck you, Wormulon. Gets me one. Alright. <laughs> Hello, Sonic Shard. How you doing? I'm okay. I'm okay, I swear. I've still got ten and a half hearts. <laughs> Dang it, Wormulon. Get away from me. Oh. Yeah, fuck you. Alright, I don't think spins are really gonna help me at this point. Oh. Let's do this the old-fashioned way. Oh. Eh. Oh. Eh. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, jeez. Oh, Come on. No. Fucking Wormulon. You shit. Ready for you. Yeah, come get some. Alright. There we go. <laughs> so dumb. What do we get for our trouble? Oh, hey, the silvers. Okay. That's reasonable. I mean, no bow to use them with, but something we don't have to go hunt for later on. Uh, that relegates us to some really nasty out-of-the-way items, doesn't it? Yeah. Fortunately. Zora, Agna, and Cave North of Graveyard is pretty much all we got to go on. Which sucks. Sizzity sucks. That's how we do sometimes. Ba -ba, ba -ba, ba -ba, ba -ba. Ah, uh, I probably should have gone to Kakariko first so we could hit Cave on the way over. Ah, uh, screw it. Screw it! I'm committed. It is usually very dangerous to go alone, but as beefy as we are right now, I think we'll be all right. Even though we only have plastic sword, we've got a lot of hearts, we've got red mail already. Things are looking okay for us. Really use a hook shot though. Hook shot would be nice. Or magic cape so we could get uh, boots and hammer. Really fucking fly. Paying 500 bucks for here. What do we got? Nothing but a bomb cap. What a shit. What a shit. That's uh, unfortunate for us. It was like a minute and a half just to get a bomb cap upgrade. Thanks, fucko. Alright, well, that was a bummer. Two more places. Well, then I guess we can dip into pod and first chest of swamp. That's about it. Oh, I suppose we can go... No, we can't, because we don't have a clue. I was going to say we could go into the back door of desert, but we cannot. Just waiting on one item to kind of <clears throat> blast everything else wide-ass open here. Dude's got quite the arm to keep that spear above ground for that long. Ah, what a throw. Do -do -do. 
Two spots we've got easy access to. What we think is gonna be in here. Ba, ba, da, ba, ba. Ah, big old 20. Dang it. Well, that doesn't really help, does it? Does not help. That leaves Agonist Cave and First Chest in Swamp. The only places we can go right now. I guess we could dive into pod as well. That's probably gonna be our next our next stop after Agony here. way to get into pod probably the uh, portal just to the south SQ back to ouch back to the house those we can check desert ledge while we're over here even if uh, we can't get it be something. Ah, it's a big old 20! Back. Alright, well, next play is gonna be pod, then. Stupid... Ah, this seed sucks. I knew I should have been very suspicious when it gave me a moon pearl right away, straight out the gate. I should have known. I should have known bad things were gonna happen. just doesn't give you something without expecting something in return. <clears throat> ah, thank you for the sub, Sonic Shard. Appreciate that. Is it still a sub if it's not a... Yeah, I guess it is, right? Oh wait, I can't go in this one because I don't have a hammer. F! Oh man, uh, we're gonna have to go over to Kakariko then. That is the only one I can get to. Ah, dang it. Well, that was a waste of fucking time. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Uh, Alright, whatever. It's fine, it's fine. We didn't need this to be a sub too. That's okay. <laughs> Alright, it's fine, it's fine. Um, All right, so what's the what's the best way to get over there now? I guess to go along the north side instead of swimming to the south. Um. <clears throat> if I had done this the smart way, I would have uh, done Agonist Cave first, then Cave North the Graveyard, then uh, then Zora, but did not have that sort of foresight. Oh well. I think I should be able to get over there by heading to the east and then dropping down, getting up at the ledge, and then heading to pod. Other option is to go for that single chest and swamp, which, ugh. There's a progression item in there. I'm not going to be happy. <laughs> I will be very unhappy if that happens to be the case. All right, let's see. So without the hammer, I think I can get maybe three of the five items? Or no, I should be able to get all of the items, I think, in pod. I just can't um, finish it off. Well, it depends if helmosaur has got something. If Helmosaur has an item, I can't get it. So I'm going to have access to at least four out of five. I think. Yeah, 
Oh, actually, no, that's not true. I don't have the bow. Fuck. All right, well... <laughs> well, this is a really dumb dive in the pod, then, but I really have very little option. Very few options at uh, my disposal here. Unless... Unless pod is uh, nice to me and gives me the bow right away. That'd be really cool of it. Be really super cool. But who knows? <laughs> Determination. That's right. That's right. It just takes a little bit of moxie sometimes, you know? Just a little bit. Yes, I did get the Dundertale reference. Thank you. <laughs> Good game. I like Undertale. It's a very nice game. Alright, this will probably be a small key. At least I'm hoping it's a small key. Duh. Well, that, um... Hmm. That puts us towards Skull Woods. <laughs> okay. Never mind. I guess we ought to pod. <laughs> you know what? That's probably good. That's probably fine. Um, that keeps us out of the rest of pod until we get the bow. Um, so that probably worked out for the best. As confusing as it was. Whatever. Let's see. Spellwoods is a normal ass crystal. <clears throat> it doesn't give us the other five sixer, but it does give us one more item. Just the one more item, since we already dove into pod, or not pod, excuse me, Skull Woods. Uh, what did we get in Skull Woods? Oh, we got the blue mail. That's right, that's right, that's right. Quite useful, as early as it was. Now we're going back for the crystal and the other item. Ah, and with half magic, this will be hopefully a little bit easier. I don't dig having only the uh, plastic sword for this, but half magic plus fire rod equals toasty, toasty Motula. on this song is a little bit weird. Please be item. It's the compass. Dang. Oh well. Uh, I do have a red and green potion, so we should be okay. Oops. <laughs> ah, no! Oh, jeez, that was dumb. Oh, no! <laughs> Dude, come on, I'm supposed to be gaining health, not losing it, and I fucking lost that one. All right, good. Ah, fudge. All right, fuck it. <laughs> Cut your losses. Ah, oh, oh, oh. So we don't have to dink about with that other, ouch, Ipso, since we already have this small key. So let's get the fuck out of here. Excellent. All right. Time to make some burnt ass bug. Eh. 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 Ouch. 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 <laughs> Uh, I don't know if that one registered. Ah, 
Ah, good. <laughs> a little bit worried about that. All right, so what do you got for the last item here? The cape. Excellent. That's really good. That gets us to the boots and the hammer. And crystal three, I guess. All right, we got a bit of a fetch quest to do here. A little, little small one, tiny one. But it gets us some really good shit. item menu. <clears throat> a lot along the edges, but not so much in the middle. Oh, ah, you fucker. Stupid bird. <laughs> Pterodactyl or whatever the heck it is. Please. Stop it. Ouch. Ow, fuck. <laughs> Alright. That gets us a few other places. You know what? While we're here. Before we get the hammer. Oops, I don't know why I just didn't go over another another screen before doing that. Oh, well. Another three hundo. I guess that's not really that valuable anymore. Done all the things that require money. A better sword. Okay, worth the trip. That gets us to spin strats Ganon, which is not ideal for me. But hey, it's better than not having it to begin with. us to the hammer in the library. Uh, I think right there? Okay, good. <laughs> Alright. Now, we've got a few things open to us. Good old hammer. Opens up East Side Death Mountain and Dark Side East Side Death Mountain. Egg cave and ice. We can do ice. We can get. Uh, we can get a little further in the swamp. We can get that other item in Thieves Town if we so choose, which I do not choose because it's buried real deep. We'll do peg cave while we're here. We'll go up to Mount Death's uh, <laughs> Death Mountain. So that is a whole buttload of items up there. 15. On the order of 15 or so. Nothing in Peg Cave. Alright. Up, 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 up the mountain we go.
note there. Alright, so since uh, I don't want to do Spike Cave just yet, we'll hit Spike Cave on the way back. Uh, I don't get that item. Alright, good. Is this supposed to be a speed run? Well, yes. <laughs> it's not going great. RNG has not been very kind to us, plus I'm not great at it to begin with, so, you know. Uh, alright, so what are we doing first here? Nothing up there. Can we... we could check T-Rock. Let's check T-Rock. Oops, I already got the hammer. Yeah, this one, unfortunately, is not very speedy. Uh, busy Bambos for T-Rock today. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. And plus we can do... Uh, we can get the very first chest in this one. Got the boots. Yep. Ah, <laughs> there's Bambos. Alright. Boom. We can get into T-Rock. We can actually finish T-Rock, which is really strange. Very strange that we were able to finish it, like, straight away from here. Uh, which I'm kind of hemming and hawing about doing, to be honest with you, considering there's five items in there, and it's a crystal. Might not be a bad idea to just knock it out right away. But we'll do the rest of the mountain, I think, and then we'll, <clears throat> then we'll head into T-Rock. Big old 20. The book. We have attained literacy. Hmm, so now what would be the best way to go about doing this? I think. Hmm. We mirror out here, do Spiral Cave, and do the rest of it. Uh, hmm. Actually. Let's go do uh, Spike Cave first. Oop, careful. Do Spike Cave first. Uh, should we do Spike Cave first? We should have enough to get in and out, I think. enough magic and or health to get in and out without a problem, I hope. I think all this is health, right? Okay. I'll be able to get out of here now, too. It's candy. Ah, crap. Uh, <laughs> I hope we'll have enough to get out. Okay, good. Yeah, we should be all right. All right. <laughs> Oof. Okay, so while we're over here now, we can check uh, Ether Tab, and then we can go back and get the rest of East Side, Light Side Death Mountain this time. Then we can head into T Rock. We got on Ether Tab today. Nothing but bombs. Dang it. Should have grabbed that fairy first. Oh, well, we can get it on the way back up. Ow. Can, really? 
Seven more items here before we hit up T-Rock. <laughs> Although... Hmm, now I'm kind of second-guessing my decision to do T-Rock here. It's candy, refill... Build 20. Since we can do desert and ice already. Uh, but if Hookshot is in T Rock, we're gonna regret not going up there sooner. Hi, please. Build 20. Arrow cap. Piece of candy. Come on, give me something, please. Ah. Uh, Ah, dang it. Nothing. That lot of nothing here. Uh, Alright, I'm probably going to regret this, but I'm not going to do T-Rock just yet. We're going to go do Ice and Desert first. Actually, I'm going to check Bombo's tablet first since we'll be on the way, but... Let's see, Ice and Desert combined is four items, but... Oh shit, no. Five items, but Ice is also a pet. Dang it. Uh, that's probably not a good idea. Although... Dungeons are, I believe, favored in the uh, placement of items. How's the current situation? Well, the current situation isn't great. It's not very fast, which makes me a little bit worried, but at least we've got things to do. We've got places to check and dungeons to do. It's not the worst thing in the world. We're still missing some key items here. Like the hookshot, you know? The hookshot there. But now we can get into desert, which is crystal. I think the only things we're missing for go mode now are hookshot and the bow. And then we'll be good. Well, I could really use another sword upgrade too, but it's not strictly required. Oops, bonk into that wall. It's on the torch, we got a small key. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba Big key, all right. <laughs> it's something. useful anymore. But, I suppose if there's a key item in Mire, and Mire requires Aether to get into, it'll be something. Now there's the other item. Okay. So, we don't need to bother with <clears throat> going for the big chest. Fortunately, that means there was no useful items in here. Which sucks. But, uh, you know, that's how it goes sometimes. Check Desert Ledge too, so maybe this will be something. Eh, big ol' heart container, alright. Useful enough.
<laughs> oh, I'm gonna have enough magic for this. Do I get these? Uh, oh, this could be interesting. Although I do have... <clears throat> I do have a green potion. I might just use that so I can have fire rod on Landmo here. Cycle land mode. Good use of the fire rod. Compass must have been in the big chest. There's crystal number four. We are way behind. <laughs> That's alright. That's okay. Uh, ugh, so what does, this, what does this give us? I guess it gives us access to swamp. That'd be our next go. Bunch of slow ass garbage going on here. Swamp has a fair few items that we can actually get to now, although we can't complete it because we do not have the hook shot. It's probably our next best bet at this point. So let's see, how many items are we guaranteed to get out of this? One, maybe three or four? Uh, ugh. Probably at most three, I would say, we're guaranteed to get, or be able to get. So hopefully one of them is the hook shot, so we can just tear through the rest of it right away while we're here. Not, that'll be another double dip to our name. Three hundred rupees, not very useful. Let's push, thank you. Big key. Uh, hoping for that. Hoping for that nice ass hook shot. Eh? Ah, busy bams. Now, well, maybe a lot of the items will be front loaded here, so we'll have more chances to get some cool stuff. Ow, fire bar, please. As if not, this will have been a bust and a waste of time.
Oops. Correct direction, idiot. more chests that we can get. Uh, it just doesn't leave us a whole lot of opportunity. One of these, at least one of these is going to be the burrito or the compass, I bet. That's just how it's been going tonight. Ouchies. But we will see. On hookshot. <laughs> yes! Alright. We can now finish this off. Excellente. Now we are just missing the bow. <laughs> All right, we're in go mode now, suddenly. <laughs> Fucking excellent. <laughs> oh, Swamp Palace, you cheeky fucker. <laughs> oh, suddenly, suddenly go mode. All right. <laughs> All right. You know what? You can't argue with results. You cannot argue with results. My goodness. That's hilarious. That is hilarious. <laughs> Hookshot and bow. This is right next to each other. Ridiculous, man. A little ridiculous if you ask me. Just a bit on the ridiculous side. But hey. No, no, ar no arguments from me. Ouch, fire bars, please. Ow! Oh, good. Now it's beeping at me. Ouch. I think I've got a red potion. Just in thing, just in case things get a little hairy, we got a red potion. It's fine. Oh, man, I didn't even... That's right, I forgot that pod was a pendant, so we didn't even need to go in there. But it's a good thing we did since we got the fire rod. Compass and burrito, perhaps? Yeah, nice. Hmm. So wait, are we gonna be missing an item here? Did I forget to mark one off? I think maybe I did. How about sink heart? No? Alright, whatever. I think I forgot to mark one off. Because then Argus will have the last item here. And that will be that. Alright, unfortunately this means we're going to have to do Argus kind of the slow way because we do not have tempered or better. Oops, excuse me. Oops. Yeah. Here, here, we, here we go. Here comes the 360 no scope. Ow! Oh, no! Oh, oh. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Yeah! Eat shit. Eat shit, Argus. What do you got for us? A big old 20. Thanks. Thanks for nothing. And the other 5-6er. Which is not really strictly important anymore. But... It's something. It's something. So that was crystal... Oh, Eastern, right. I was thinking, uh, there's still one more I gotta do. Eastern, I gotta do Eastern. Uh, you know what? No, let's, uh, let's do it this way. It's gonna S and Q back out to the house, but I think it's just about the same amount of time to run over there. Unfortunate that I'm probably not gonna get the flute. I mean, I'd love to find a, a better sword, but no guarantees of that, either. 
unless it's NT Rock. Oops, what am I doing? Like, I don't need to do this crap anymore. But I would like to maybe just mirror out to... Eh, yeah, maybe I just will. So I'll be there anyways. Probably just be SMQing out to the Mountain Cave anyways to get up to, uh... Up to T-Rock. All right, so it's a. I made the good choice by not going into T Rock early. It's ridiculous. Kind of a weird, correct choice on my part. <laughs> like a weirdly correct choice. It's a good thing I thought about doing other things before going in there. Oh, I missed it again. Ah, I fucked it up. I only got three that appear there. Huh, usually there's four. I don't have a net, so I can't even grab a backup fairy. Ah, well. Don't need it. Don't need it anymore. We got 16 hearts. We'll be fine. Hmm, let's see. We're at a buck 31 and about to get crystal six. We could still be looking at a sub two for this. That'd be kind of silly, considering how shitty this seed is going. But hey, I'm not going to complain about that. If we managed to pull a sub-2 out of this, that'd be great. Oops, totally whiffed that. Wait, 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 wait. Alright. See you in hell, Armos. There's Crystal Six. Now we're on our way to T Rock. Take out Trinex. We'll be on our way to G Tower. Probably the faster of the ways to get up there. Instead of dicking about with going into Dark World, coming back out of Dark World, pulling out the hammer, etc., etc. Plus, I guess on our way to G Tower, we can grab those other three items out of Hookshot Cave. In the hopes that one of them is a sword. That would be real nice, wouldn't it? But we don't have to do spin strats on Ganon, because I don't like spin strats on Ganon. So let's see, probably about eight minutes through T Rock that would put us at buck forty two, maybe buck forty three going into G Tower. Let's call it buck forty five. Be on the safe side. Uh, so now we're technically in go mode going through T Rock, so I don't know if I want to full clear it necessarily to look for swords, or maybe we should just be on our way. Still don't even want 
with that. Visited mushroom plus the big key. Nice. All right. Now we're in true T Rock go mode now. Mushroom really does us no favors. We're not going to pop out and go turn it in. I think we'll just get up and get in and get out. out pretty well. Sometimes I got trouble with the Chompy Chomps. They, they were very friendly. need magic. <laughs> well, I actually kind of do, but not for a bit. Essentially banking on there being a sword in G Tower somewhere. Hmm, that actually should be all the keys we need, too. We don't even need to hit the laser bridge at all. Awesome. I'll shave off some time. Eat a fire bar in the face. Ouch. Oh, crap. Uh, I missed it. Eh, back up and around. Uh, there we go. <clears throat> you know, I'm always happy to not have to go into certain dungeons uh, like ice or the extent of pod, really. That's the best. Saves us so much time. Turn this into a maybe, possibly sub two seed instead of a 215 or a 220. Unfortunately, we're gonna have to do hammer strats here since I've only got Master Sword. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, wait a minute. Ice first. Uh, is that gonna hit him? Nope. That should hit him, though. Ah, one more. Ah. Oh, you fucker. There. There we go. Whoop! Ah. Alright, next. Why you gotta- Ow, oh, you gotta be such a pain. Dang it. Stupid ice. 
Ah, Jesus. All right, well, we're going to have to be a little bit careful with our magic usage here. Oh, nice. All right. <laughs> All right. It's not exactly an ideal fight there, but whatever. We'll be fine. Ooh, careful. Ouch. Come get some. Come get you some, Trinex, you some bitch. Alright. <clears throat> How about you give us a sword? That would be real nice. Oh, it's a shield. <laughs> Baby's first shield. Okay, that's fair, I guess. Bum 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 bum. Alright, well here's hoping that we find a sword on our trip through G Tower. That'd be real nice. Real, real nice. Otherwise we got spin strats Ganon, which is slow as heck. And also rather dangerous for me. I'm gonna check this cave real quick since it's three items we can grab. Big ol' 20! Bomb cap, and... Oh! Bullseye! A sword! Excellent. Alright, no spin strats Ganon, I like that. That's real great. Now, if we found Butter Sword in G-Tower, that would be even better. Everything's better with butter. Now we hit in G-Tower at buck 42, that's pretty nice. We don't get totally boned by RNG on the big key. We're looking at a good shot at a sub two. A good shot. Not a guarantee, but a good shot. But now would be the time to get your guesses in for what item will be the big tower, or <laughs> the big tower. Cannon's tower, big key, one through 22. Place your bets. Here comes one and two. Real quick like. The shovel. Not really worth anything. Small ass key is fine. Looks like this is gonna be a flutless seed as well, which is not exactly common. 50 rupees on the torch, that's number three. We'll be at four through seven in short order. Here's four. Small key. Five. That's 50 roops. Six is another 50 roops. Seven. The big key at number seven. Hell yes. All right. That's real early. I love that. Plus three small keys, so we will be fine on that count. And we're, it's looking like a strong sub two is coming up here. And I, I like that so much. In the mix, really? All right, we just gotta not fail the gauntlet super hard and we'll be, should be good to go here. Oh man, I'm feeling real good about this now. Half health through the rest of the gauntlet. Not ideal necessarily, but oops. With that one. But if we play a little bit carefully, we should be okay. We still have we still have a red potion for backup. We should be okay. Oh, nice run, just barely. Didn't get poked in the butt that time. Ah, dang it. <laughs> you got a little aggressive there. It's alright. Oh yeah, gotcha, shit. 
down to five hearts. It's not great. Ouch. Four hearts because of laser beams. Three hearts because of running into them. <laughs> we'll pop that potion if we need to. Nice shot. Oh. Oh, boy. Ouch. Two hearts. Back up to three, down to two, oh, down to one! Oh! Oh, just barely! Can we get that arrow shot? Yes! <laughs> okay, we're... We have no backups anymore. So we going with this. Ah, oh, dang! Just barely missed the one cycle. There we go. Clean two cycle, though. <laughs> Alright, it's been a pretty good gauntlet so far. Let's see if we can pull off the rest. Whoop! Whoop! Oh, oh dang. Ow, oh, dang, those guys are on point. Alright, it's fine. Nice, good shooting. Quite the one cycle I was going for. That's alright. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me, pardon me. Ah, oh, damn. Oh, shit. Uh, we might have fucked this up. Yeah, we'll just wait for it. Dang it. Slight time loss, no big deal. I don't need to bother with these guys. I'm gonna I'm gonna check this one just because. Big old twenty. All right. <laughs> Plus, we still got validation chest. And Moldorm the second to deal with. Easy peasy. Validation chest has a piece of candy. Not even good for a fill up. Bad bumpers and shit. There we go, that should be a good lineup. Alright, Gauntlet went pretty well. If we don't get dumb bullshit patterns from Jerk Wizard in a second, we might pull back a few minutes on this. Eh. There's two, I like that. Good two to open it up. Yeah, only a single there because I'm standing in this dumb place. Ah! Blue balls. There we go, that's better. Ow! Oh, couldn't quite get the double on that. So, was that three or four? Well, not gonna get that, it's too far away. There we go, that's a better pattern. There, okay. Not bad. Not bad. A solid uh, G Tower Big Key at number seven. Good Gauntlet, a good Jerk Wizard the second fight. Yeah, this is looking like a solid sub two. I like that. I like that a lot. Let's see, ten and a half hearts, no potions, a decent amount of magic. Let's go for it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Go in there, take a risk, gain some time. We got this. No nutrition experts recommend that at least half of our daily grains come from whole grain products. That's that's very good advice, Ganon. Thank you. Very kind of you to be looking out for our health. 
Oof, that was a... Gave him a talking to there. Be pretty close to phase three after this. Ooh. Give a couple of good swipes just to make sure. No, still not at phase three, huh? <laughs> oh, oh, I'm surprised I didn't. Oh, ah, crap. Yeah, at least we got him. Two, excuse me. Hey, shit, come on. There's three. Ooh. There's th er, four. Four, four, excuse me. There's four. I did find the arrows in Tower of Heroes. Fucking rad as heck. Uh, that's not gonna do it, probably. Ah, we missed it. That's right. Wait on this. Shit. I don't know if we're gonna make this one either. Ah, dang it. Alright. Can we get the last one here, perhaps? Yeah, eat shit, Ganon. We did it! It's gonna be a buck fifty-two. That's great. Well, it's not great, but it's something. <laughs> it's a sub two. Which is about the best we could hope for out of what happened there. Excellent. 151.48. We'll take that. <clears throat> hey, Mr. Gecko, how you doing? How can you speedrun a game with this much randomization? Eh! It's fun. It's fun. It's mostly about execution at this point. Like, usually I'm pretty happy if I get a sub-2. That's, that's about my measure of this was an okay seed versus a really shit seed. Okay. I'm gonna let the credits roll. I'm gonna go refresh my little drinky drink, and we'll come back for round two. Be back in a couple minutes.
Prepare to fast forward. Somehow. There we go. <clears throat> Alright, Sonic Shard. See you later. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you again for the sub. Mm. That was my couch cash at MSP. I'm glad that wasn't an MSP seed. That would have been really stupid and dumb. MSP seeds are really dumb. <laughs> they are really dumb. I think I've only had two of them, thankfully. We'll check the stats here, and then we'll get reset. Started on number dose for tonight. Got a really early sword. Uh, I think it was in the well. No, it was in the thieves' den up in the lost woods. It was our first sword. Moon pearl was right away in the house. Uh, let's see what else was there. Hammer was in the library. <clears throat> But the boots were in Bumper Cave, so we had to wait to get the cape before we could take care of that business. Uh, where were the mitts? The mitts were on Zora Ledge. Power Glove we got from... I want to say... Mini Moldorm Cave? Eh, I don't know. We didn't have to go into too many places where that weren't required, except... Fire Rod was in uh, the very first chest in odd which was a pendant and it's a good thing we went over there because otherwise we would have been fucking digging for that yeah first sword was pretty quick <clears throat> boots were pretty late we did not find the flute at all mirror was pretty early fortunately we had to go with plastic sword for a while master sword was a little bit too big key for Ganon's towers at number seven which is great Three deaths, I think one of which was intentional. Or no, I don't think any of them were intentional, really, but... Worked out pretty well! Buck 5148. That is nothing to sneeze at. 